my god, I should be showing you my nails, so of course. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It has been a hot minute since I've sat down and actually spoke to you guys, but I'm glad. I'm glad to be back. Today's video is going to be a bit of a haul. It's a Bali haul. I'm just going to show you guys what we got from Bali. I know it's been a few weeks, but I haven't really been doing any vlogs. Yeah, it's been a bit hard with everything that's been going on, so I just hope everyone's keeping safe. And yeah, let's just have some fun and look at some cute little things I bought in Bali. I've been gone for a minute and I probably should have done this video like weeks ago. But guys, I was flat. And when I say flat, I mean I had no motivation to do anything. So the fact that I'm sitting here doing this right now is like a pat on the back. I'm like, okay, we're doing it. We're getting up and we're just moving on. We're getting on with it, you know? Okay, let me show you guys what I got from Bali and... <laughs> Hope you guys will like it. You can hear Aiden. Aiden's always featured in most of my videos. So one of the first things I did when I got to Bali is I got myself one of these cute little Balinese bags. These are sold here as well, or in most places, but they're like way more expensive. So I didn't buy one before I left because I thought I could get one there because, hello, they make them there. And I think I got this one for like 20 bucks, which was, I think, quite cheap because look at like the intricate detail guys don't mind my nails quarantine i haven't you know they're just popping off one at a time so let's just ignore that i love love the inside of it the detail is amazing so i got this one for myself and i had this while i was actually um in bali using it all the time i absolutely loved it i loved it so much that i got another one for, I don't know, just like as a gift for somebody. They're gonna have to fight for it. But I got this. It was so cute. Look at the details, you guys. How cute is that? I loved the front of it. I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. And of course the inside, the inside is always pretty. And I got a little one as well. I got a little one, um, if I can find it. It was like a little pink one. I just had to, I just had to get it. Oh, look at that. It's like a little pink bag. Oh, look at that. It's super cute. So I got three of these. I think this one was like $10 or something. Um, and these ones were like 15, $15 or $20. I can't quite remember. So I got like three of them and they're super cute. I like all three of them. Oh, look at that. The next thing I got is of course, You gotta get one of those. Like, okay, so when you go to Bali, for those that haven't been to Bali, Aiden needs to stop. You go to Bali, for those that haven't been to Bali, they literally all their markets are selling like fake, like bags and fake like shirts, just like fake designer stuff everywhere. It's literally like other than the woven bags and like some stuff like household stuff, like straw stuff or like wooden stuff. These are like in popular demand. They're literally sold everywhere. It's very budget, as you can see. So it still has Gucci inside of it, but you, you can tell like it's very budget. Um, and I think the guy was asking for like 30, 30 Australian dollars. And I think I like priced him down to either 15 or $10. I'm going off my memory, guys, because it's been so long. But the locals actually say when you butter, you always go half the price. So if they go $30, you go $15, and then you kind of work, work from there. And I got this Chanel wallet. You can tell it's like, you can tell. It's like very budget. So they have like budget items in like the little market areas. And they have like stores, like actual stores where they sell like fake you know designer stuff but they're way more expensive because they're more like replicas like they're more authentic looking but this is just like you can even hear how cheap it is when you open it <laughs> you know still cute could be a gift someone could have this i mean if you open it real quick you know get it out of your bag someone might really think it's a chanel you know just just quickly <laughs> like quickly of men's wallets so i'll get a few because I have a lot of uh, men in my life, a lot of brothers, my dad, 
cousins, etc. etc. So I thought easy gift wallets. So that one's the first one. It's a Gucci wallet. That's a Gucci wallet as well. It's the same one, just different um, colors. I quite like the black one. It's super cute. I got a Louis. I got a Louis. I actually like this. I don't mind this at all. It's cute. It's a bit bent. <laughs> but like, you know, if you don't pay too much attention to it, you'd never, you'd never notice. You'd never notice. The shoes looks like... Oh, it's a Louis. Another Louis. So I got a couple Louis and a couple Gucci wallets. Um, and I think I got another Gucci one, which Mike liked so much that he claimed it. So it's, it's, it's like one of the other ones. So yeah, I've kind of seen it. Another thing that's very popular is shoes. So they have a lot of fake shoes, a lot of fake Nikes, um, a lot of fake designer stuff. And me and Mark got this. I got some for myself and he got some for himself as well. I got some Adidas Supreme. Supreme shoes. They're actually comfortable. I've only tried them on. Um, they actually feel comfortable. Um, they don't feel bad at all. Like the fabric feels alright. Like they're they're actually not bad for what they are. So I'm pretty sure these retail for like what is it a thousand dollars? Almost a thousand dollars. And we got them for forty Australian dollars. So these are mine. And then I also got Mark a pair. So these ones are Marks. So Marks are Yeezys, and mine are the Supreme. But yeah, they're actually not that bad. They're actually not that bad at all, you guys. Um, he's worn his a couple of times and he says they feel very nice. Um, the fabric itself feels, it feels nice. So it wasn't bad. It wasn't a bad, um, I did this easy. Oh, it actually says it inside. It wasn't bad, this one. So, you know, if you don't want to buy $1,000 shoes, you can always opt for the replicas. They're actually pretty good. They actually feel nice. So um, these weren't a bit a bad buy. So I bought this, which is a uh, sarong. So I loved this because I felt like, okay, this is so Balinese. Um, if you can see the pattern, it's so cute. It comes in this little bag. It's got this little, I think it's a coconut shell on it. I'll just show you guys what it looks like. It's such a cute little packaging. So it just comes with the sarong in there. And that's what it looks like. It feels really nice. And the ends look all frayed. It's, yep, yeah, it's super cute. This is gonna be a gift um, for someone. <laughs> so yeah, this was really nice. It was one of like, a really good finds that we found just before we left. Um, I think we got this uh, back in Semiak on our way back to Australia. So this is a really good one. Okay, so I tried to get some stuff for the house, which was hard, but I managed to get a few things. I managed to get this. This is cute. It's like they're coasters, um, and they cost only three dollars. So it comes with this little like. I don't even know what to call it. Like little cakes for the coasters. Um, oh, and this is what the coasters look like. This is just the back. How cute are those? They have different fabric. Um, oh, different patterns on the fabric, sorry. So it's one, two, three, four, five, yeah, six. How nice is that? This is a perfect gift. Like a perfect like household gift for anybody or if you want to buy it for your own house it is super cute i love it i love that every like coaster has a different pattern on it when you're done you just put them in the little pouch and put it somewhere that is so cute three dollars you guys three dollars i just wanted something wooden i didn't i couldn't afford to buy a lot of stuff because i didn't have space so i ended up buying this She's like salad tosses, like sticks for tossing the salad, and it's so cute. It's so cute, you guys. And I think we got this for like four dollars fifty. So bargain, absolute bargain, and it feels really nice. But yeah, 
really nice. A few more coasters. Um, I just wanted this because I thought that was super cute. But these ones have little like shells on them. Oh, how nice are those? They're super cute. I only got three because at this point I was already spending way too much money on gifts and stuff. <laughs> So I was like, let's just buy a couple. But I really love this. If I could have bought, they had the bigger ones as well and the medium ones. If I could have bought those, those oh, would have been so nice. But these were more expensive than the other ones. They literally cost like eight bucks for three. That's a lot. That's a lot. But you know what? I appreciated um, the attention to detail. So I was like, all right. I'll get this. I feel like those ones were e easier to make than these ones. As you can see, a lot went into them. So I didn't mind paying a little more. So I got this fan, but it's like one of the first things that I got when I got there because it was hot as hell. And this was like $5. It's super cute. It's made it all the way to Australia. It's still alive. I use this almost every single day, you guys. It was hot. Like I'm not even exaggerating. It was so hot, so. I'm thankful for this fan. Get it when you go, if you don't already have a fan, definitely. Also got a hat. I didn't have a hat when I first left, so I kept thinking, oh, I don't have time, I'll just get one there. So I just got this cute little hat um, from one of the um, stalls that somebody had. You guys probably saw me buying this hat um, in the first video when we were in Semiak. And yeah, I think it was like $10 or something. I can't remember how much it was, but it's so cute. It's got like frayed ends, um, if you can see it, which is super cute. So I loved it. I wore it every single day. It was the best. We got him some, some of these. We got him some Gucci flabs. <laughs> They're cute. They were like $20, so it wasn't bad. I quite like these ones. They're not as hard. Do you know how like they're usually hard here? They're not. They're like rubbery. I actually like rubbery better than when they're really, really hard. So I feel like they feel nice. But yeah, they were $20, super cheap. Not that expensive. And yeah. We got a few like cute little hats. This one's a Supreme. And this one, wait, it's the same. No, oh, yeah, it's an Adidas. And I did his little hat. It's a bucket hat. We got two of these because they're super cute. We got them for the kids and I think they'll absolutely love them. Ate in a few t-shirts. He is totally joining the Gucci gang. How cute is that, you guys? So cute. I love it. Okay, it's so cute though. Um, it says small. They don't really have sizes, but I think he can fit them right now. So we got a Gucci, we got a Tommy Hill figure. <gasps> Isn't that the cutest? I have a Gucci t-shirt that's like this. I didn't get it in Bali, I got it ages ago. So I can't wait for us to like be matchy matchy and wear our little Gucci shirts together. <laughs> so I thought that was super cute. I also got Aiden this. It's a little giraffe. Toy, like fluffy toy it's so cute you guys it's like really firm so I think it's got like a bunch of cotton in there but how cute is it the first day I showed it to him he was shit scared of it like literally he cried but now he loves it he sometimes like hugs it, it it's it's cute I think I got this for like $15 I got this at the airport like just before we left so that was cute most of our shopping we did in Semiyak we didn't get time to go anywhere else it would be nice to go shopping in Ubud and stuff but we didn't get a chance so yeah that's where we mostly got everything last but not least I got this cute little magnets little Bali magnets they're flip-flops um that say Bali at the bottom if you can see it oh my god I should be showing you my nails so I'll go <laughs> I have one on my fridge and then I'm gonna give it to a few family members but it's really cute it's like a cute little cheap present and this was like two dollars it was two dollars you guys it was super cheap super 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 cheap you can get this at like any convenience stores like they have like convenience stores and they sell like little items you can get this and stuff like that so you can just pick one up before you leave or whenever it's small you can go in your bag you don't need to have space for it okay you guys that is it for this video that's everything that we got while we're in bali i'm glad to finally have shared with this with you guys because it was video i was meant to do a few weeks ago but you know what it's 
you know, it's never too late to do something, so here you go. I'm going to be doing a whole lot more videos from now on. I'm definitely back in the groove of it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you like. I can't wait to be hearing of other people's adventures when we finally get through this and we can travel and go to the world again, you guys. I can't wait. Anyways, guys, take care of yourselves. Be safe at home. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.